let us see an example on this. Let us say x of n is given as 1, 2, 3 and 4. Okay. Uh, my origin is, is at 3. Okay. And what do I have to find? I have to find x of minus n plus 2. Okay. Since my origin is at 3, that means my 0 is at 3. Okay, let us draw the table now. The first column is n, second column is x of n and the third column is x of minus n plus 2. Okay, what are the four values of n that we have? We have minus 2, minus 1, 0 and 1. All right. And these are the four values of x of n. Now, let us calculate x of minus n plus 2. Uh, okay. So, we are just going to substitute the value of n from here. Okay. So, x of, okay. you understood what I did here? I am simply substituting n with the value minus 2. So, this minus sign that is there, this will stay. Okay. Do not get confused. So, this is what I am going to get plus 2 plus 2. So, it is going to be x of 4, the value of which we do not know. So, it is simply going to be 0. Next is minus of minus 1. So, this is going to be x of 3, the value of which we do not know. So, this is also going to be 0. This is what x of 0 plus 2, the value of which again we do not know. So, this is also going to be 0. Uh, with here, we are going to substitute x of minus 1 plus 2. We have the value of x of 1, which is nothing but it will remain 4. Okay. Now, we have we have 3 0 values and we have 1 non-zero value. So, we are going to need 3 more non-zero values in order to make a graph. Right. Um, so, the next value that I am going to try for is a positive value because I know if I take a negative value for minus uh, for n, then I am simply going to get a positive number which I, I, I do not have the values for that. So, I am going to try for 2, n is equal to 2, n is equal to 3 and n is equal to 4. Okay. So, I do not know the value of x of 2, x of 3 and x of 4. Now, I am going to substitute this over here minus 2 plus 2 which is nothing but x of 0 which is nothing but Uh, which is nothing but 3. Okay. Then I have uh, x of minus 3 plus 2 which is nothing but x of minus 1 which is nothing but 2. Okay. And then I have x of minus 4 plus 2 okay, which is x of minus 2. The value of x of minus 2 is 1. So, now, now I have I have 4 non-zero values. Okay. So, from my table, I have got, I have computed x of minus n plus 2. I already have the values for x of n. So, now let us draw the two graphs for comparison. This is n, y axis is x of n. Okay. This is my original signal, original and this is my modified signal. This is my n and on the y axis I have minus n plus 2, right? All right. Now, for my original signal, it's going to look something like this. Okay. 
and the modified signal is going to look something like this. Okay, so this is my original, this is my modified. Okay, and what is this called? This is called as signal folding and delay. 